Oh yeah, sexy biscuits. Nice. Long black clothes, 2. I'm running the, well, this is the 360 uh, version or port, I should say. I'm going to assume it's arcade perfect. I honestly don't know. I just downloaded it through Xbox Live. I think it was 3 dollars I'm just trying to use up all my credit that various people gave me as gifts before I install uh, Game Pass. I don't know, it's an OCD thing, but obviously this is a port of the 1994 arcade game, which is a sequel to the 1993 arcade game, which is absolutely groundbreaking in the first 3D fighter, Virtua Fighter, which used flat shaded polygons, whereas this is still mind-blowing and amazing, uh, uh, you know, back in the day. I have gameplays of it on the Saturn 32X. Uh, so this used, you know, texture mapped polygons and what did it run at? Something like 60 frames a second. Uh, the two iterations of the arcade uh, game, I believe, and it was phenomenally successful. And graphically at the time, nothing could touch it. It got a port to the Saturn that absolutely blew people's minds. My brother had that port back in the day and I was actually pretty good because we used to play quite a lot on it. In recent years I got a Saturn and this is a game I got for it because it's still one of the best looking games on the Saturn and it's an incredible port for all the restrictions that were placed on it by the hardware and it runs at 60 frames a second I believe. Obviously if you've got an NTSC version I got gameplays of that as well and I played that a bit and got used to it. Why have I got this? I always quite fancy just seeing what the arcade version looked like you know uh, obviously this is at home and this is 360 but you know what I mean because it's one of those games that if I I never saw it in the arcade back in the day and I always really 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 want to and I have nostalgia attached to it because of it showing up in Saturn magazines and stuff like that and brother having it in the whole PlayStation 3D fighters versus Saturn 3D fighters. I'll get into it in a minute. So I thought for 3 dollars I'll give it a whirl. I never said, because I haven't played it in uh, Donkey's years, that I am any good at it. Because I haven't played it, like I said, in Donkey's years. So I can't remember any of the bloody moves. This is just kind of, for me, uh, a trip down memory lane. He's going to wink, isn't he? He's going to wink. Uh, I don't know why they didn't use the art from the, the characters below in that screen. I always find that weird. But yeah, this is just me. For me, this video. Uh, hopefully there's some Virtual Fire fans out there. Don't, you know, expect anything because, like I said, I don't know how to play it. Why am I using the analog stick? See, to me, I don't know if this is... Okay, perfect. Oh, I forgot about the floaty kicks. Yeah, no, this is okay, perfect. But, to me... This looks stunning. Still, I know. Uh, vintage rose tinted. Ooh, what was that? Uh, vintage rose tinted rose tinted goggles. Now, here's the thing. I am aware that it's weird. People have to explain to people back in the day. It's a fighting game with three buttons. One of which is block. And yeah, you know, one punch, one kick, and you can do all these things. Yeah. It's one of those ones, pick up and play, incredibly easy to master, incredibly difficult. That's weird. Is that a thing that should be happening? Oh, he talked over his punk ass comment. But, uh, and again, I mean, I think, let's have a look. There is options, uh, help and options command list. There you go. Hey, at least it's got it mapped for your know, colour for Xbox buttons. Right, well, I don't know what any of these are, but I feel I fucking hate that button. It keeps doing that. But yeah, so it's in there. You know, you can see from that list. There we go. Nice. So, yeah, you can see from my list, it's got a huge amount of potential for moves. There are an insane number of moves. I'm sure someone out there can explain to me just how many moves there are there, but there's a lot. Oh, little cheeky Jackie Chan there. 
Get some of that, you like, you drunken bastard. Should have called drunk, uh, Drunken Master 3 that. Drunken Master 3, Drunken Bastard. Oh! Keep pressing that button, and it annoys me. Alright. The sample speed seems a bit pants. Maybe that's just me. Maybe I should get a white stick. Maybe I should get my ears checked. Maybe I should start drinking too. No you don't. Press the button again. Piss off button. You're getting on my tits. What else is there? Like I said, I don't know uh, anything about how to play this game. This is just uh, a trip down uh, memory lane. Let's try that one. So it's... Oh, I got it. So yeah. Obviously, back in the day, you would have to get all that information by something called a manual. I know, and get this. It was in paper. I'm not a massive fan of the sound quality in this. I'm not going to lie. Like, Also, maybe someone can tell me. I always forget it's the opportunity to do a jump on them when they're on the floor. Oh, quick pauses in my speech. So obviously, this is full polygonal backgrounds, which you were bloody cocoa on something as powerful as 360. I mean, obviously, the arcade, it was the most powerful, was it the most powerful arcade board at the time? But obviously, the Saturn was, was it scaled, sprite, 2D? The thing is, the actual characters themselves on the Saturn. My voice failed me then, awkward. Actual characters themselves, what did he say? Uh, on the Saturn themselves were well impressive. Well, well, well impressive. So, was that glitches in this? Is this is this because I'm running this on an Xbox Series S? I do remember that I tried to download this on my Xbox One and for some reason it simply would not do it, which is annoying. Uh, maybe I'll dig out my 360 again because I do have Daytona on that and obviously that's not available anymore. Oh, wrong button. Totally brings you out when that happens. Jackie as well. Uh, all the library rays. Oh, nice. Look at that. Cheeky. So, I mean, it certainly is not a fighter where you can buy a match. I mean, I know. Oh. Oh, look at that. Cheeky little brawler there. Yeah, uh, obviously Tekken is a game that requires just as much skill, memorization, learning and stuff like that. But, you can, you, you, come on. You cannot argue that Tekken, that you, you every now and then, you'll get beaten by a button masher. Just by fluke, I understand that. This simply cannot button mash in. You could argue, though. That's exactly what I'm doing. See, it's Leon, Lion, I don't know, that I always liked. But there's no denying, it's his moves, are just like the animation. Yeah, the animation this way is superb. And isn't this the first fighting game to be motion captured? I don't know. Was the first one not motion captured then? I understand that this is a very random video, but that's me all over, isn't it? How to play controls. All right, well, that's helpful, isn't it? How do I... No, I'm lost. I can't find... There we go, command list. There's a lot going on in here for me who's just got back from work. Side hook turn, um, spinning kick turn. Uh, behind opponent. Oh, look, look at the stuff that's going on. Again, imagine when you had to read this from a paper manual. Wow, look, look, look. Yeah, remember, good luck remembering all that. I'm Generation X. I can't remember what I ordered for breakfast. And I only had it an hour ago. Cheeky! I always find it funny that it's got a ring out on this stage, but the ring out is not actually the water. Alright. 
cheeky little fucker. I'm trying to remember anything now. That works. This is the music. Which, again, is quite quiet. Right, we'll go one more round. Maybe one more character if I lose. Um, but, yeah, this is... This is just a visit down memory lane. And again, the moves as well. They're, they're amazingly animated. Right, he's never... No, there's a floor, then a high. I can't remember. But they also have weight, especially her moves. They have a massive amount of weight to them. Maybe, since this is on my hard drive. And I've got two pads now. Oh, get some light in your life. I'll uh, invite my brother over. And we'll have a couple of, you know, relive the old times. And uh, have a couple of, you know, one-on-ones. And see what comes flooding back. What's weird though is playing this on a, and don't get me wrong, I think the Xbox pad is absolutely phenomenal, but it's weird not to play it on a Saturn pad. I know, I know, lots of excuses, lots of excuses. Well, guess what, mate? I did. Oh, wait, by the way, this is not the standard screen size. This is one up from standard and then it's stretched, and I ain't stretching because it looks awkward, much like that then. I don't know anyone else's moves off the top of my head. Well, I don't know anyone's moves, period, did I? Alright. See, if you did this now, or was he in modern... What was the last Virtua Fighter? Five? If you, yeah, you had some bloke who's pissed out of his box. Fucking everyone would lose their shit, wouldn't they? Pussy has modern brigade of fucking... Games reviewers and Shizen. Although, is it in. No, nope, there he is, he's drinking. I was going to say, is it insinuated that he's pissed? Rather than he's pissed. If you know what I mean. I guess we should have a look. I want some combos, mate. This is where my brain just goes, yeah, it's not going to happen, is it? Alright. We'll go swigging then. Oh, hello. Cheeky. Yeah, do you know what? Again, um, nostalgic member berry, goggles and shit like that. Sounds shit, I'm telling you, it sounds shit, but this looks stunning. Determined to connect with that. See that? Is that polygons in the back? Yeah, yeah, I don't know. It's a depth thing, isn't it? It looked like it, then it didn't look like it, then it looked like it, then it didn't look like it. Anyway, Virtual Fighter 2, the arcade game, a um, bit on the 360 on my Xbox S. But it looks fucking stunning. Again, remember very glasses, goggles, and shit like that, but I think this looks stunning. I'm gonna have to break out, because I am a Tekken boy at heart, Street Fighter 2 and Tekken, I have to break out the manual, um, it's in the game obviously, and commit some time to this, because yeah, this is awesome, I wonder if I should do a comparison of it against the Sega Saturn, seems a little bit unfair since this is running in HD and my Sega Saturn is running on RGB, anyway, as always, I'd love to know what you think, uh, is this a broken port, the glitching, or is that backward compatibility issue, and yeah, what did you think of Virtual Fighter 2 back in the day? Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you later.